Now, I uh, had a little problem with solder. Only a little problem, temporary setback. The soldering iron that I tried to use just wouldn't give me enough heat to get the solder to run. Well, you just can never have too much light in the workshop, can you? Um, I've been, I guess the phrase is messing about. I showed you a piece of horrible copper wire and I tried soldering that but the iron that I've got wouldn't put enough heat into it to melt the solder that I've got. Uh, no great surprise because it's a tiddly little iron and all of my other irons and torches and what have you are a little bit too far away for me to go and get them just to do a little thing like this. Now, dear old George said, why not dribble some super glue or some white glue down it just to hold it in one piece? Well, I dribbled some ordinary white PVA down that and that's bonded the trunk together haven't worked out what sort of tree that is I guess we better ask Ken um, what do you reckon Ken what should we do with this tree it's got to have some glue stuck on it and some foliage and paint and things like oh no good asking Ken about paint is it um, he knows about trees he knows diddly about paint I've, I've seen that uh, but there we are that's a start I've got plenty of, of scrap wire, odds and sundries, uh, so I, I think that we're going to make a forest. Well that Ken you know, he knows a thing or two about building a proper model railway. He said why don't you use the neck as a trestle? I think that's a smashing idea. Guitar neck bridge. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs>